water crisis. The mayor of Flint saying she wants to remove and replace lead pipes as quickly as possible. 7 Action News reporter Dave Llewellyn joins us live in Flint with the latest on this. Dave. Particularly the lead service lines into homes. Mayor Karen Weaver is calling on full cooperation from the federal and state government to fund this project. She's estimating it will cost $55 million. And uh, they want to do this for all the homes here in Flint. Now, the city of Lansing has been doing this for years, and the mayor has called in experts from Lansing to help get what she's calling this fast start program up and running. If you have a household that is having 150 parts per billion of lead, chances are very good that it's got a highly corroded water line. Why not, in a simple calculus, say, if that's the case, let's find out the corrosion in that lead line. So we're not doing all the lead lines, but for those that we believe have, are the highest risk, and that's one of the factors, why would you wait on those households? Of course, money is going to have to be appropriated for this work to be done, and that's why the mayor is calling on the state and federal government to fund this project and she wants the money in a hurry. They are going to start with a test of 100 homes to check for how bad the corrosion is on these lead service lines into homes, but they're going to get started and then they're going to ask for and demand cooperation from the feds and also the state to make sure this is done as part of the fix for this water crisis here in Flint. We'll have more on this on later editions of Action News. For now, we are live in Flint. Dave Llewellyn, 7 Action News. A huge job ahead, Dave. Thank you so much.